we started off the week, and the uh, first thing we said on Tuesday morning uh, was, what, what do they want at the end of the, the season? Um, and, you know, I, I'm really happy for the guys. They truly wanted it for what, what they wanted uh, out of this last three or four weeks. And they showed by their high-character kids. They had the hardest week of practice. Um, they believed, and, uh, you know, it's very tough to handle adverse situations in life like we've been going. We've been and adverse, what I mean by that is it's not really, it's adverse in our little basketball world. It's not adverse in the big, in the big picture. But in our little basketball world, uh, they, they, they handled it with high character. I was really proud of the way they came out. Um, and, uh, and yeah, we, we talked about a lot of different things this week. And I thought we, it was the first time we looked down the line and thought everybody was truly helpful. There's games that we've had, a missing guy here, missing guy there. Or even if the guy's in the lineup, he's, about 50%, you know, Walt tried to go with a bad shoulder, uh, Joe's tried to go with everything. Um, and uh, I, I was really happy for these guys uh, to get that feeling, because uh, it's been a long time coming. Coach, uh, one of the most astounding things was the three-point shooting percentage, 57%. It helps, <laughs> doesn't it? Take it helps, doesn't it? But you know what I, what, I, what I thought we did is, it wasn't just a three where it was one pass and just pull the three. Yeah, I thought we moved the ball very, very well. We had 19 assists today. A lot of those came off good spacing, good ball movement, and uh, you know, a lot of unselfishness. So we've been working, we did a lot of shots this week. The guys really stepped into the shot. And uh, I said I said in the pre-radio show with Fitz, I said, this is Jordan looks as healthy as he looked all year. Uh, he had his best week of practice, uh, and he's just looking confident. And uh, it, it's really shown in his shot. Jordan, talk about what this victory means.
good. But that's the, that's the kind of team we are. We gotta have contributions from everybody. And today, I, I look down this box score, and I can look at Christian, Walt, Jordan, Joe, London, Denzel, Jim, Ben, and just say, all of those guys made, made really good plays to help, really good plays to help us win. And that's the type of team we have to be down the stretch. We gotta be a team where everyone's bringing what they can bring to the table. And I thought tonight was, collectively, we had more positive plays from a deeper group. Jordan, uh, talk about the, the rivalry, if you will, the cross-town rivalry. Uh, <coughs> it jacked up a little bit more. Yeah, uh, so, yeah, since I've been here, you know, it's always been USC and Lale. And um, just this week, this whole week, we've been, you know, thinking about getting this win and starting this off. You know, um, Coach said, you know, we're 0-0 zero zero at the beginning of this week. And, you know, what better way to start off than play against the rivalry team than I think we're against USC. Coach, any particular reason for London getting to start today? You know, we, we've um, he's brought tremendous defensive intensity um, with that, and he's um, he brings a, a high energy to that. We want to really, you know, I, I thought Talton Barnes really hurt us last game, 18 and 16. We really want to just start out with a high energy, and it was, and, um, and Denzel's came off the bench, and he, and, you know, he's I think he he did better, kind of seeing how the flow of the game went. London came in and gave us a high energy defensively. And uh, that's that's why we want to do it. We were doing a shift. And, you know, Ben and Jim and London came off the bench and all played well. Or Denzel came off, yeah, Denzel, Jim, and Ben all came off the bench and did well. Maybe the uh, shooting is going to come and go. Yeah. Uh, not gonna, everybody's not going to shoot this well as a team. But uh, the rebounding you guys dominated the boards and that sort of thing is something you can control as a team. Yeah, that, that was an emphasis too. I mean, they're a very good offensive rebounding team. Uh, so we had, we had to keep them off them. Um, they're getting that to keep them off and getting off the three off. We knew that we, you know, we could attack it and, and secure the boards, and then we could push it because they, I mean, they send they send a bunch of guys um, to the offensive glass and control them, and we could get out and get some advantages. What, what would you tell uh, uh, recruits or young guys who are thinking about perhaps going to Loyal and become part of this program? What, uh, what, what do you see? I see uh, when we look at things in the future, I mean, the foundation's being put in this year. It's always tough when you're, you know, six and eighteen to, to look beyond that. But I mean, I think that 